original friend locks, starter locks, dreadlocks, they don't know. Dancing to your glad you are here. I know the cool you can't fool me too nice for that. <laughs> don't know. Save miles of black star liners coming in the harbor. Vibes, vibes. Okay. Vibes, okay, vibes. I see. You know, Fred Locks represent every time. Present. Love. Rastafara. Big up London. Reggae vibe. Dancing clear and really cool. No love. One love like Bob Marley International. International. Into international. Give me a team piece of your thing. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome, my beautiful people. I'm Aikiva. And we're still here at Caveman Studio. Mm -hmm. And in my coach here with me, we have the legendary Fred Lux. How are you doing? Great. Thanks. Yeah, right. nice. right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. So right now, mm -hmm. While you're at here sitting down with me, I want to ask you a few questions for Reggae Vibes Dancing Clear yeah, and Rudy Cooley. Yeah, They're in Jamaica now, as you can glad see. To see them. Dancing Clear, <laughs> they've come from Jamaica and Bamboo on their first trip, but we're glad to see them. Give thanks. We have to talk about yes. that. I want them to come again. Let's see. Yes. <laughs> Don't be a stranger anymore. Yes. I'm going like a Lord Ranger. Yes, I want to ask you a few questions. Yes, yeah, ma'am. What age did you get into the music business and uh, um, what inspired you? Well, I was, uh, my father yeah. was a great guitarist. Mm -hmm. And I have a brother who followed him. But my father now used to play guitar and tell me to come sing some songs. Come so learn to sing the, some songs that um, we overseas to, like some Nat King Cole mm -hmm. and um, some Dean Martin, them kind of Bing Crosby. Yes. But my likeness was like the Platters okay. as a black group. So I even recorded Platters songs while Twilight Time in reggae. So when I was about eight years old, my father used to carry me to the bar, put me up on the block with me and me sing, mm. and people give me money and them hat. <laughs> so that's them. Very nice. Yeah, man, I'm so, eight years old, you know. Mm -hmm, very yeah. nice. So what, um, so which, what was the first single you bought for yourself, your song that you take your money and go there and said, I believe in this, I'm going to buy this single for me. The you. world greatest, Dennis Brown. Okay, I was Yeah, man. Okay. No man is an island. I buy that mm -hmm. for him. I said, Dennis Brown, when first time you hear him, when I show him nuggets to the need, I said, nobody no bad like him. He must sing a tune him, King Solomon. Okay. Yes, yeah. at nine years old, I think he was. Mm -hmm. And when we see him, I said, superstar. That. I must be D Brown. Everybody wants to be D Brown one time. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> so, um, while we're at that, what is your favorite album from another artist that you really. You then know. it's going again. <laughs> Inseparable Bro. album. What? Nice. Have some sweet shows. I think the, the King of Reggae should get ready to Bob Marley pass. You know, how can the King pass? And I said, the year is still the Prince. Mm -hmm. That doesn't sound real. So, in you the past the and in the future and present now, who are the artists that you really like to work with and why? Well, why? You know, the modern years, since then it's going to kind of drop the flesh, like, you know, step out of the flesh. Mm -hmm. Love Lucian. I think I'm consistent. I'm mean, love to sing the notion. As a singer, I love singers. I'll sing to you now, since I'm a favorite. Okay. It's like I make a trip to show you now and then, the world is nice. Mm -hmm. Then, you must come to the studio <laughs> and tell yourself, but I want to hear an empty rhythm, you know, just give me a rhythm key and make me go on vice. Right. See? And all the whole day I'm spending on those vice. We seem to turn the three tunes for one day. Mm -hmm. I'm a real sister. Right. I'm going to do a call up with him. I do have a black star and I will sing to her. All right. Yeah. Um, as, as I said that um, about Sizzla Colon Tree, right? Mm -hmm. Can you describe um, your music and how long you've been writing? Yeah. Is it from the start of when you knock and say, I'm going to do this? All right. or so I, I wrote the first time when I was 12. Right. Because my father had to tell him to encourage me to sing some tunes, some realize you could I write some. You know, our time does not like nowadays where them give you a rhythm. Mm -hmm. We used to write my song with, with a melody. And then you sing it and the, and the band find it, the key way you're going to sing. So I'll be writing the first song when I was 12. Okay, so yeah. what is the, um, the top three types of music that you like? What genre of music that you like apart from reggae? I like soul music, you know, American black soul music. Very nice. Yeah, and I, and I love reggae, of course. You know, I love some of them dance and things, so I'm going to tell you the truth. I like how to be them so, but I'm not pro project not positive too so tough. Mm -hmm. And I think the kind of rhythm evokes some kind of the kind of thing what they must think about. Either going now, girl or something, you know. Mm -hmm. It's one and two people come on with some positive. Nice. But we still love it. 
Yes. I will not apply the new them. Uh, so, uh, as a legendary artist, what is your goal? What would you like to see for reggae music? I want to know? get back international, like what Bob Marley carried. But it's coming like it kind of take a little dive <coughs> because I think infiltration from overseas, I would like to do with it. Jamaican music inspire American music, and, and Jamaican people think that American music inspire them. <laughs> you see, right, because right. the first rapper you have him says, You are a mystic. Mm -hmm. Curtis Blow. Right. If you notice nowadays, the man being global over thing, the American with hip hop thing, have some good. Jamaican thing. Good. Good. good, and I'm going for the artists, them yeah. over 80 artists in America, they have Jamaican background. Right. Alicia right, right. Keys, Miss Elias, name them. We didn't even know that. <laughs> so I think we carry it to the world, so we have it. Yes, so yes. Me, me, me really like how the dance hall music still remains mm -hmm. um, relevant that reggae could have come back and take its place. Right. Like nice. Jamaican artists keep a thing alive. Nice, nice. Right. So um, other than music, what other work have you done before? I mean, I tell you, I never like another work. I'm so <laughs> so bright, I mean, I tell you, I'm very, very bright. I'm going to learn you coin when you say a paint card. Yes. I'm going to learn it because I'm going to like you, you know. Mm. And the youth will teach me. When you go, when you never come work one day, the man said to me, I said, you have to go do the job, you know, because the man will come to him car, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. The man, uh, the man said, you're better than your teacher. <laughs> so when, you learn fast. Yes. But that's an apprentice about two months, you know. Right. You said the man come and boss around you, the man said, the student by the line, the man thumping her mouth and bust up. <laughs> and I feel like happy about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, the man say, I'm happy about that, I'm a big girl. Oh, no. I say, you know, I'm mean, not joking, you know. I'm you know. <laughs> All right, then, so, um, <laughs> other than music, other. All right, then, um, so if you could go back in time, what would you do have you done different? I would do nothing different. I know I would do nothing different. No, that's the US thing. I get my calling from early. My father was a great man. You know, my father said one day, I never understand until we get bigger. Mm -hmm. He said, I'm not religious, but I'm God fearing. Right. See? And me has a one with me by that. It's a parable, right? Yes. So I checked it out. Mm -hmm. My father, when I was 17 years old, my father looked at me. I could play football with them, they called soccer. Some man who used to make them make a side, couldn't play like me. My two good for them. But they may have <laughs> Yeah, man, serious. And my father looked at me at 17 and said, Where you want to go, you go? I said, I can play football good and I can sing good. He yes. said, well, choose the one where you can do the best because anything that you can do good, you must pursue it and you will benefit from it. Well, unfortunately, I'm never getting preached out and sing it, but we love it. I'm a first love. <laughs> so, yes. um, right now, what kind of music um, is Fred Lux listening to right now, lately, right now? Not at all. What kind of music? I listen to Dennis Brown here, yeah, man. We love fun that she goes in the disco. Mm -hmm. I think I'm the sweetest wife from out of Jamaica. When I want to sing, I love Tabby Diamonds. Mm -hmm. I hear the man sing uh, some soul tune. I put one day to the rest of them sing that. That's true. Yes, yes. that's true. They watch one of them love sing. Or go again, man. I don't remember it right now. Mm -hmm. When Diamond sing that tune, there, mm -hmm. everybody sings that the original. Okay. But Tabby and Sanchez, I think, are the sweetest wife. No. Yes, man. Them wives are sweet. No love singers. Them singers are part. Right. One of the rubs are just kind of bad, bad man, the bird here too. God bless him so much. Great singer that. Okay. So me like singer mostly, but as I said, we, we kind of choose it. So when it comes to the one we bring DJ and him to a melody, we can't sing to you. Mm -hmm. Sizzle again. Great <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. artist talk. out of Jamaica, come on. Yeah, so, so um, some of the artists are great, yes, man. Yes, um, so. I well, we listen to Caesar, Lucian, and Dennis Brown, nice. Michael General. And when you do your album, I can listen to you too. <laughs> Thank you. And I feel back now here. So, and um, Demos, you think I leave with Demos all day? Yes, I am. I have some children. So, um, I want to ask you this question now. So, I see you have a lot of number one hit, legendary song. Every song a number one. What song? Which one of the songs that you're really, 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 really Proud of. Well, and I, why? I watch you them through Rasta, man. True Rasta, man. Yeah, them call it soldiers. Say. When we go to England one time, we go to the show, we inside a restaurant, and I look a bunch of you can come in and say, The IFS look familiar, I know nothing. I wish, what do you do? I said, I'm a singer. Yes. I said, which tune you sing? I said, Black Star Line. I said, I know that tune. Any other one? Mm -hmm. I said, true Rasta, man. I said, then I thought you were first, man. Because <laughs> 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 you see when revival dance, he would not play that. A pure shot, my lick. 
seen so we say, well, in a land that you know, so you have people who love them things differently. But you are someone I really might too, you know, love. Yeah. So every time we go up on a show, we sing it first. Like it, for the pick the kind of character me, you know. And they were running tell myself about 20 years years and it's a new like the old bit song. Black Star Line has a powerful song. Yeah, but I'm sure I'm a big song, it's a signature song. What am I telling you? Me, I really love to ask them. Other than if you never have the time, I'll ask them again, friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 If you go and do it, you see, tell me, just tell me one thing. What you want, 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 what because me was a man with a tape on, tape of the character in spray on the wall. Right. An apprentice. Yes. So me I watch him keenly. Yes. Watch him keenly. I'm a learning thing, but he never know. Not, not even me to know. Yes. But when the man said, I have to do the job, I think I do some good for him. So you're saying to me then, other than music, if other than getting the thump in your mouth and all that, other than you, if you were doing the music, then you would stick to it. Yeah, I'm going to do body work. Right. I'm going to include some girl. Come, can work on them body that girl? <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah. Yo, thank you, thank you. Tell us that this chair is hot in here. Oh, oh my God. God. I'm so hot. Oh my so, um. Right, so <laughs> thank you. So, um. All right, then. All right, on a serious level. Sorry. Yeah. Leaving this coach, is there anything you want to say to the people them out there? That's watching on reggae vibes and um, anything conscious they want to leave with the people. I want to big you up first. I've been never going to interview with us. We want to record next to about you, eh? She does say, take it up like nothing, and it should just not run. So, what I tell him, tell him, member, she. Thank you. Sweet like that, too nice, be and good looking. Yeah, man. They're ready for the thing. So, all they know, worldwide, man, said, too much war. Jamaica, especially. Mm -hmm. 1,600 people murdered. Oh. A demon loose, that's the last year. The it's year just started and gone 70 years. But you're so small for the Jamaica, for per capita, the size of Jamaica, the amount of murder will take place. You hardly have any country that our city with that said size, mm -hmm. where so much people get murdered. Come like we have a civil war. But don't you think we have a, um, artists like you out there have a part to play? You know, just come together and and, and unite and and you know try to, 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 to reach out to them in a sense where you know where you come together and do a world song and tell yeah, them to uh, stop that it. Night, that night. Well, like you know because there are some powerful artists out there they're not doing enough to help eradicate crime as right. well. We're just waiting on the politicians and well, all. I agree with you in part. I can't help. But over the years people like Bob Man work for people, Michael Jackson, the we are the world. They will yes. change the world at all. You, you think so? You don't change nothing. What I even think is, Christian Empress, tell him this. It's prophecy fulfilling. Okay. You know, the last day, because men shall become lovers of themselves. Mm -hmm. And love of men shall walk school. Mm -hmm. And men shall give unto seducing spirit. Right. See? Mm -hmm. Bowing to iniquity and all kind of things. Right. So, I'm sure you say, as much as we try, I want to say that we're going to ask us, we're going to do some show and say, I'm going to say, hey, Rasta, we're not hear nothing from you. Go away! I'm telling you that, I'm telling you that, the Vipers. Yes. That happened already, you know, I'm telling about in the 70s. One time, a night of being gay, set up right to go over to Ida Selassie High School. So they're going to keep a peace thing, and I'll be a pure kettle. I want him to like it. I said, you don't have to throw down your arms and stop kill off one another, you know. So I'm going to just come with some dollar and say, Rasta, come out of the place. You must be able to kill my family. Can't tell about peace. Go away! <laughs> that was a real revolutionary thing there. Yes, I'm not sure I said. Rasta Lal Field said to his eyes, it's the last year it's cool, you can go to the sun. They will respect that. Yeah. And that has happened in the 70s. Right. No, I'm not saying them, them unredeemable either, but I feel we need divine intervention. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you, yeah. thank you. Tomorrow I'll tell you what I'm saying. Stop the crime. See, stop kill off one another. Right. Because nobody don't benefit from that. Only modern them <laughs> and the federal part of them. Thank yeah, you, Fred Lox. Thank you. It was a historic, historical 
um, Trad, you take me on. Thank yes, you sir. for being here, uh, representing for Don Cooley, Don Seeker, and Cooley. Yes, right, yes, right. Sarah yes, Thank yes, you, man. thank you very much. Welcome, Welcome to yes, Reggae Vibes. Yeah, man. Big up, Dan. Awesome. Big up, Andrew Cooley. Nice. All right.